actually a pretty safe fucking <laughs> way to live your life is to wake up afraid of something. Right. Like, all right, I gotta get up and seize the day because. <sighs> <sighs> No, yeah, I mean, I, I kind of, you know, I went through, like, my weird trash house phase uh, when, when, like, I moved in with some college girls. They all graduated, moved out, and I moved all my dirtbag friends in. And then at some point, the house got too fucked up, and they didn't even want to live there anymore. So I had a, it was this four-bedroom place that was, like, you know, me and one other guy. And I was like, well, what are we going to do with this room? I was like, well, hmm. So we had a pornographic DVD, <laughs> as you do. Uh, and this one was good because it was one of those value ones where it's just like it's it's just the full sale of it is just like it's it's three hours long, <laughs> and you're like, all right, great, that's like you need that's a good amount of time, and it looped, it looped. Uh, so when that's it would lot. get to the end of the three hours, that's a really long time. That's a really you need like ten minutes on a DVD, I think. <laughs> value <laughs> okay right right i can't argue that i mean you know if they, they, it would have been smart they would have had a menu that gave you a random 10 minutes every time you push play right but right so this thing would loop at the end it's like the 100 mario challenge exactly yeah, porn DVD. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pick expert pick expert for that one uh, so we set up a tele. We took one of these extra bedrooms and then just set up a television in it and just like said, well, we're, we're just going to have this porn film looping forever, 24 hours a day. Like you'd walk by the room and look in and go, huh, huh, uh. <laughs> and just keep moving. And just like, you know, it's like, those things are just like, oh, well, let's, let's take pictures of, you know, I have pictures of friends of mine, like holding guns next to the porn TV. <laughs> And it's just like, we just like wanted to just like, let's just go full weird militia nonsense. And they're just like, holy, they're all like pellet rifles or something. They're holding it, saluting. And the two of them are standing there between this, like, just, you know, just porn loop. And when, on the rare occasion when other people would come into the home that didn't already know that we were fucking idiots, uh, that painted a pretty clear picture pretty quick. It, it let people know what they were in for. They were like, oh, I totally don't want to be here. Okay, I have to go and we're like yeah you probably should i don't want to be here either you know like this isn't we can't get anyone else to live here i wonder why weird uh yeah are you, are you trapped in a thought right now just it was a good dvd it was a long no it was a long dvd it was a long dvd which for some people is probably good but I mean, that's you know was it was it if you don't mind me asking uh-huh it was a compilation DVD, or is it one couple, just three hours? It doesn't happen. Like sitting down to dinner, like just throughout the day, like should we should we do the sex thing again? Yeah, okay. That's uh, is that how it is around your house? Should we do the sex? No, no. <laughs> I've got two kids. Okay, no, yeah. you're all right. Yeah. Are we sitting down to dinner? No, uh, no. This That's was one. This was either. one of those things where, like, I, I guess I should clarify for those of you in the room who haven't extensively researched pornography back when you got to get it on DVD. I mean, the internet changed everything, obviously. Uh, the ones that advertise, like, the length of time on them yeah. also tend to advertise all sex! <laughs> what does that mean? And no story getting in the way. <laughs> no one's delivering a pizza. No one's just like, oh, spring break's going really great, you guys. Yeah. Like, no one's like, I'm a bank robber on the run and I need gas, but I don't have money. What am I going to do? I'm a pretty lady bank robber. <laughs> I drop my coins all over the all floor. All these coins are everywhere. I got to get down all fours and pick up the coins. That's, that's, that's awesome. I can help you with the coins. <laughs> oh? Oh. <laughs> no, none of that setup is okay. present. It just doesn't need to be there in these situations. <laughs> this is like the sort of film... This is the sort of quality production you would purchase at a convenience store where okay. I buy all my movies. <laughs> they didn't have vending machines in California. They had vending machines in Kansas for porn. That, it that would just be like, a vending that, machine that, yeah, that was literally it. it would be that like, sounds like some Tokyo type shit to no, me. No, no. Go to Lawrence, Kansas. Bottom couple rows are like condoms and lube and stuff, and the rest is all like is really it, shitty alley? porn. Like, what is, where is this? Uh, not a bowling alley. Okay. <laughs> okay, because if you're going to tell me, like, hey, you went to an adult bookstore and they had a porn vending machine, I'll be like, of course they did. I was in college and there were a lot of strip clubs in Lawrence, Kansas. Okay. All right. Yes. That makes sense. Yes. If yes. you were like... It wasn't like at the Hardee's or whatever. If you were like, hey, you know, I was at the tennis courts right. next to the church yeah, yeah. and... It's not you know, a Kmart. It was like, I needed an Nestle Crunch bar and right. then I was like, three hours, all sex. I'm like, well... <laughs> Can't play tennis all the time. <laughs> you can play tennis all the time, though. 
Why don't they make tennis video games anymore? What happened? 